Welcome. This is a tutorial video on how to launch a blockchain in just five minutes with Komodo's Antara Composer. Let's dive right in. First, let's navigate to the Antara Composer. If you go to the Komodo website, komodoplatform.com, you can click the Try Antara Composer button, and it will take you to the Antara Composer landing page. Let's begin. First, we click the Sign Up button on the left. We'll need to enter an email address and create a password. For this test video, we'll just use the email address antaratester at protonmail.com. And, of course, we'll need to make a password. Always remember to use a long, secure password with numbers and special characters. Okay, now we need to agree to the terms and services by checking the box. And finally, we'll need to confirm that we're not a robot. Now we just click the Sign Up button to create the account. At this point, the app will have sent an email to the email address we used to create the account. We'll need to switch tabs to the email account, which is open here. Just open the email and click the verification link. This will open a new tab that takes us back to the Antara Composer landing page. And now we'll re-enter the email address and password that we used to create the account. All of this ensures security of the account and prevents anyone from gaining access to it. This is the dashboard of the account we've just created. We can see that we have zero blockchains, so let's go ahead and make our very first one by clicking the Add Your First Blockchain option. This is where things get fun. You can see that there are many different options to choose from here, just as we have a quick scroll. Let's begin by naming our new smart chain. We're going to name ours Wine Chain, imagining that it is a supply chain solution for shipments of fine wines. Now we need to choose our pre-mined supply. We also need to choose our ticker. Let's just call it Wine1. Now we need to enter our KMD address. So let's just copy this address and then paste it into the box. Next, we need to do the same thing for our pub key, which is also pulled up here. So we just copy and paste that, and we're all set. OK, we're ready to add our logo. And this is just an example. It can be whatever you want when you make your own smart chain. Let's add a short description of wine chain. We can say, a chain for wine, for rare wine, delivery tracking. And now, we'll save the description. On to privacy settings. We'll pick public only for wine chain, since it's intended to track rare wine and needs to be transparent. Next up is consensus rules. We will keep wine chain at 100% proof of work. We also have the option to enable Antara modules. We'll definitely want to enable them for wine chain to use things like the Oracles module for our shipment tracking. We don't need to offer any blockchain rewards for WineChain, so we'll select No Rewards here. At this point, we're ready to launch. We just click the Launch button at the bottom left of the screen, and we're off. This next screen lets us choose all of the additional features and white label products that we'll need to launch the WineChain project. As we can see, there are many extra options to choose from. The last step is to pay for the smart chain. We can pay with cryptocurrency or with fiat currency through PayPal. We're going to pay with crypto, so we will click on Pay with Coin Payments. Now we need to enter our name. Antara Tester. Then we select which coin we want to pay with. We will be paying with KMD. We click Continue Checkout to move on, and we are automatically redirected to a payment portal where we see the amount of KMD we need to send and the address we need to send it to. So, we will copy that address. Then you would simply open your wallet and send the correct amount of KMD to that address. Once the payment is sent, we will see this screen, which is just letting us know the transaction is being processed. It might take up to 15 minutes for everything to be processed. In the meantime, we can view our order. So, here it is, 
It's just a summary of the wine chain that we've just created. We can see that the status is launched. We can also check out the Your Blockchains option on the main navbar. We can see wine chain here, and we can click on it. And that will show us the dashboard for the wine chain project, which shows that the chain is currently launching. We can also view a lot of other info and details about WineChain. Now, we'll let the video skip ahead just a few minutes to give the payment time to process and give the WineChain time to launch. Okay, and we're back. We can now see that the WineChain is online with three connections available. We can also open our custom block explorer to have a look. And here it is we can see that the very first block in the wine chain smart chain has been mined. If we click on it, we see all the details, like the block hash and the address that the coins went to. Back on the Antara Composer, we see all the other details about wine chain. Notice that SPV servers are still pending. This takes a little time, and they will be available when block 32 is mined which is about half an hour's time. Apart from that, we're all set. The wine chain is up and running, and we have customized and launched our blockchain in just five minutes with Ontara Composer. Thanks for viewing, and have fun launching your smart chain.